This video is going to be about some important Windows optimization settings you need to enable right now on your PC if you wanna get next level performance out of your PC while you're playing games with your any PC or laptop. And guys, most of people are watching this video without subscribing, so please subscribe because it's hurt a lot because you are making content and people are not appreciating it. So guys, make sure to subscribe, drop a like on this video, and with wasting any time, let's dive straight into it. So guys, in the very first step, we are going to configure some important registry settings of our Windows that is completely safe but help you a lot to boosting your FPS. So guys, for that you need to press windows are together from your keyboard and type here reg edit after that click on this ok button hit yes once you get in the registry editor now you need to follow this path so guys in the very first step go for hk local machine and click on this drop down now go for system and click on this drop down now go for current control set and click on this drop down now go for services now scroll down and find the t-series so guys once you find out this t-series the word starting with the t guys there you will find out this tcp ip so click on this drop down and now go for the parameter and click on this drop down button and there you will find out this interface button click here so guys here now in the directory you will find out these two registry files so go for the tcp ac key frequency if it's not available here so guys right click here go for new button and click on the d word 32 bit value and use the same name after that guys right click here go for modify and change this value data onto the one now click ok now go for tcp no delay click on this modify and guys offset the settings onto the one hit ok so guys now the next step we are going to do an other optimization for our registry which will help you to making your game more responsive so again go for hk local machine and click on this drop down now go for softwares and find out microsoft click on this drop down now press w from your keyboard and you will find out windows nt here click on this drop down go for current version now again press m from your keyboard and find out here multimedia click on this drop down again go for system profile and guys there you will find out system responsiveness now right click here and go for the modify now change here this value data onto the 0, 0, 0, 0 type here 8 times 0 and click on this ok button and guys that's it so guys now the next step we are going to unpack our cpu and we are going to use windows d bloat for optimization of our pc for gaming so guys for that you need to download these tools on your pc and for downloading these files on your pc join my discord server link available down in the description simply join my discord server go for the download button and there you will find out unpack cpu app for gaming optimization click on this download button after that here you will find out windows 10 deep load increase fps and overall pc performance click on this download button and download this txt file also on your pc once you go here this both file now go for the first rar file double tap here and drag this exe file here on your desktop now double tap and open up this application hit yes and here you will find out simple interface of the cpu unpack application so here is our cpu core parking as you can check out here enable core is 60 and park core is zero so you need to also apply the same settings on your cpu for having the better performance while you're gaming so guys in the very first step go for the power section and there you will find out system power plan click on this drop down and select out the bit some highest performance if this power plan is not available go with ultimate performance power plan or high performance power plan whatever is available right now on your pc after that go for core parking index and click on to the unpack all and this will unpack or set all the slider on the 100% after that click on the supply button and this will unpack all your cpu cores and help you to get more performance out of your pc now in the next step here you will find out this windows 10 dbloater.txt files so open up this txt file copy this command from here now you need to go for windows search bar and search for powershell here you will find out windows powershell right click here and make sure to run this as administrator and hit yes now paste here this command and press enter and this will start downloading this application in the background and also automatically create a restore point on your pc before doing any kind of optimization so guys once it's done so here you will find out this kind of interface for the windows 10 deep load this settings also work with windows 11 so don't worry now you need to go for the deep load option and there you will find out the customized block list click on the customized block list and there you will find out all the installed services application of your windows now you need to select out here unused application or apps of your windows which you are not using and you want to remove for improving your fps while you're gaming so guys here you will find out like twitter facebook minecraft that kind of application so once you select or unselect all the application now click on the save custom allow list or the block list after that click on this close button so guys it will take few time for removing all the block of your windows after that now skip the registry changes and go for the next step which is the cortana guys click on this disable button and disable the cortana on your windows now go for edge pdf click on this disable button and then here is the dark theme and this is your personal preference whatever you want you can go with it after that guys here in the next step you will find out other changes fixes and here you will find out uninstall onedrive unpin tile from start menu and disable telemetry and tasks and remove bloatware registry key so guys in the very first step i suggest you to uninstall the onedrive from your pc if you are not using it click here and this will take around four to five minutes for uninstalling the onedrive completely from your pc after that go for the next step which is the disable telemetry 
Click here and this will start running this program on your background. Once all these steps are completed on your Windows D Bloat, now click on this close button and close out this application. So guys, now in the next step, I'm going to show you some important Windows power plan settings you need to change right now on your PC. So guys, simply go for your Windows search and search for power and open up power and sleep settings. Now go for related settings and under there you will find out additional power settings. Go for it. Now go for the best power plan like the Bitsum High Performance Power Plan, High Performance Power Plan or Ultimate Performance Power Plan. Mostly people have High Performance Power Plan so go for the High Performance but I have the Bitsum High Performance so I will go with it. Simply click on the Change Power Plan Settings. Go for Change Advanced Power Plan Settings. And now here you will find out Hard Disk Options. So go for this drop down and click on the Expand button and there you will find a turn off Hard Disk and change the settings onto the zero. After that, now scroll down and go for USB settings, click on this drop down, go for USB slash suspended settings, again click on the expand button and enable the settings on your PC. After that, scroll down, go for Intel graphics settings, click on the expand button, Intel graphics power plan, now again click on the expand and set it on to the maximum performance. Now go for processor power management, click on this drop down, now go for minimum processor state and set it on to the 100%. Now go for maximum processor state, click on this drop down and set the settings onto the 100%. This settings will help you to get the maximum performance out of your PC, from your CPU, from your GPU, from your RAM, while you're playing games or using any high demanding task on your Windows. After that guys, click on the apply button and hit OK. So guys, now the final and the last step, we are going to do some optimization for our Windows visual and graphic settings. So guys, for that, right click here on your desktop and go straight into the display settings. Now scroll down and go for graphic settings. Now from here, go for hardware accelerate GPU scheduling and turn on the settings and this will reduce and improve your PC performance. Now scroll down, go for the browse option and select out here your all the exe file of the game. Once you edit here your all the games, go for that specific game, go for option and set that onto the high performance and hit save. Do the same setting for all the available game of your PC and guys that's it. Now close out it. Now right click here on your Windows Start icon, go for system. Now go for advanced system settings and now go for the performance settings. Here you will find out all the settings for your visuals and now from here you need to adjust the settings onto the adjust for the best performance and this will disable all the useless visual effect of your windows and ultimately this will help you to boosting your PC performance. After that hit apply, hit ok again and close out your this window settings. Now guys simply one time restart your PC therefore all the changes take effect. After that launch your favorite game and enjoy the best performance out of your PC. I hope you love this video please make sure to drop a like on this video, subscribe to my channel and till that the next video peace out.